Hello guys, Ants of Britain here and welcome to the most intriguing video I have ever done yet. I guarantee, even if you aren't an Ant fan, you're going to find this video great, interesting and you'll learn something new. So watch till the end guys as you aren't going to want to miss this wild ant video. So yes, ants behave in a very different, peculiar way under the influence of alcohol. But how are ants supposed to get alcohol? They can't just nip into a bar and buy a pint. They access their alcohol through rotting fruits, also known as fermented fruits that contain alcohol. When ants eat these fruits, they intake the alcohol which is contained in the fruit that screws up the ants usual behaviours and body functions and even the smallest presence of alcohol has an effect on the ants behaviour. Alcohol in large concentrations seems to repel ants making them change directions or just pause. The productivity and mortality of the ants seem to be linked with the concentration of alcohol level 2. In small concentrations, the alcohol made the ants dig more tunnels and become more hyper and excited, but in high concentrations, most ants died. In a paper published by Sir John LeBuc in 1884 named Ants, Bees and Wasps, the presence of intoxicated ants were studied, and I quote, This is a rather more difficult experiment. In all cases, they were made quite drunk, so that they lay helplessly on their backs. The sabre ants seemed much puzzled at finding their friends in this helpless and discreditable condition. They picked them up and carried them around for a while in a sort of aimless way, as if they did not know what to do with their drunkards any more than we do. So then guys, that was a very interesting section from that paper, but let's look at the results of this experiment. He observed that sober ants would throw intoxicated ants into the water as a sort of attempt to sober them up. That is almost like me picking up a drunk KB Revelations and throwing him into a lake. But anyway guys, in conclusion, ants can become drunk alcoholics, just like as, I guess, humans can. If you ever come across one intoxicated, leave it alone, especially if it is a species of fire ant. So then guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed learning about this. I really, really found it very, very interesting. If you have enjoyed, make sure you drop a like, write a comment, share around and mainly hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more content like this. But until next time guys, ciao for now.